So when I opened this package, first I was like, damn, this thing is so small. But then I remembered, like, you can tag smaller surfaces, like railroad tracks, you know. Like, every little thing you can see, little, little stop signs, you know. A uh, little side of, of, of the stairs, you know. You can tag on all those things with this mark, so. I think this mark is perfect for those things. So yeah, I just went outside, did some texture with it. Um, didn't film that, because always when I make a video for you guys, I always like uh, tag a bit first to prepare myself for what I have to say to you guys. So um, at this conclusion, if I tag like this, real fast, the flow isn't too good, as you can see. But if I tag slow, You can see it has a nice flow. I went too fast here. So I think the fast you can go is like this. And it isn't a good tag, but you know, here, let me, this was the front, let's try it on the back. I think you have to pump this up really, 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 really much. Yeah, you know, I think it's just because of the tip. The tip isn't too good. Otherwise, you have to press really hard. Oh, yeah, and then there will come a lot of paint out of it. Yeah, well, you know, I think this mark is okay. But I try it in metal. Slow. Look, you can see the tag on the back is fast. You can see those little lines here. This one slow. So you just want to watch on your handwriting. Uh, this was the video, guys. Like and subscribe if you like it. I will in a few days. I will do a uh, dripstick roller bar, roller ball review. So just keep in mind. Like, subscribe, comment, do your thing, man.